The legislation requires schools to post that information online in a convenient place for parents and the public, but the state teachers union worries that the bill could potentially open up teachers to backlash and intimidation from parents, especially as we've seen a lot of school board meetings have people show up to complain about issues like critical race theory. You do open up uh, opportunities for bad actors in other parts of the country even uh, to access this material and use it as a way to harass teachers to um, you know, to cause problems. And that's why I do Supporters of the bill like Dauphin County State Representative Andrew Lewis say the legislation is not about specific issues like critical race theory, but he does argue that the bill is about transparency and that includes allowing parents and the public to be able to closely review what kids are learning about in the classroom. If you look at like a time ratio spent, on average, kids spend far more t daytime hours with teachers than they actually do with their, their parents. And so there's, you know, parents across the school districts really are, are interested and want to know uh, what their kids are being taught in school. The bill is headed to the Senate where Representative Andrew Lewis tells me he would not be surprised if it's amended and refined further. Tom Lehman, WGAL News 8.